Oh, yeah, all of a sudden everyone wants to drive by. <laughs> all right, let's do this again. Howdy folks, thank you for clicking on the video. Welcome to the channel. Glad you're here. Kind of a fun video today. As you can see, I'm not in my studio. I'm sitting out here on the tailgate of my Jeep Cherokee Sport. Uh, and uh, it kind of has something to do with the video because uh, a few weeks ago, uh, Philip McKnight, Mr. Know Your Gear himself, uh, was kind enough to send me some uh, some stickers, some Know Your Gear stickers. And uh, I took one of them, I stuck it on the back of my Jeep, uh, took a selfie and posted it on Instagram. And uh, Philip saw it, uh, gave, me, gave me one of those hearts, which I always appreciate. And by the way, I am on Instagram. Uh, if, if you want to follow me, it's GrumpyMike335. Um, you, you can find me there. Uh, but anyway, uh, Philip saw it and he became concerned that those uh, those stickers might not be UV protected and you know may not hold up like that so out of the kindness kindness of his heart him and the lovely Mrs. McKnight uh, thank you so much to her too uh, they uh, went ahead and made for me a uh, a window decal I've, I've got it right here uh, it, it arrived just the other day so I'm gonna go ahead and stick it on the back of the Jeep. Okay, folks, I have turned the Jeep around and repositioned it so it doesn't have the sun beating down on it uh, too terribly bad. Had to give the glass a little time to cool off, but I'm ready to get going putting this, this decal on. Um, now it comes with specific instructions right here, so I'm gonna to try to follow everything to the letter so I don't screw this up. I, I wanna get it right. Um, so step one is to clean the surface with alcohol, rubbing alcohol, which I did just uh, a few moments ago. So that's been taken care of. Next is preparing the stickers. So uh, it wants me to take a credit card and firmly rub the clear transfer side. Uh, try to remove any air bubbles that may be formed in shipping. So I'm gonna do that right now. Let's see, I guess first I'm going to need a credit card. We'll uh, get something out of the wallet here. Oh, I only need one. That's my insurance card. All right, there we go. All right. Don't want anyone to see my credit card number, though, so I'll keep everything nice and hidden. So let's get the, uh, the decal out. I've been trying to keep it nice and safe. and you're supposed to rub it, which I'm doing. I, I kind of see how this works. Want to get all the air bubbles out. I'm assuming on the parts where there's actual stickers. So, uh, yeah, that looks about right. There seems to be one, there's something right there. All right, uh-huh. I think I've done that thoroughly enough. So step number two or three, peeling the white paper backing with uh, clear tape side down, peel the white paper away from the sticker. Uh, if the sticker clings to the backing, slowly replace the white paper backing and re redo step two. So I'll do this as gently as I can. This is the part I always hate, getting, getting the backing to come off. So. <laughs> we'll see how this goes. Uh huh. Yeah, this is the part I always have trouble with. If anybody knows any tips or tricks to, to doing this better than what I do. Ah, there we go. Oh, I almost had it. Okay. I'm 
Aha, I think I got it now. Okay, that part is done. Now, step four, apply sticker to the clean surface using squeegee or credit card. Rub the surface of the sticker, start in the center. Uh, uh, yeah, this will eliminate the bubbles. So, let's pull it down. I figure I'm just gonna put it right here in the middle. I want to get it as centered as I can. And I think right there, just about, just about the middle of the window. I hope I get this straight. Oh, there we go. What's going on that way? I need that credit card. I think I got it. All right, let's see. Next step, peel the clear transfer off. That's kind of what I figured. Now let's see if this actually works. Uh, oh my goodness. Well, would you look at that? There you go. Know your gear is now officially doubly on the Grumpy Mike Jeep. So there you have it. All right, folks. I just, uh, I wanna thank uh, Philip McKnight. I certainly wanna send a big, huge thank you and a hug to the lovely Mrs. McKnight. Uh, obviously she is a saint and uh, we all in the uh, Know Your Gear community really appreciate her as well. She does a lot of work for the channel. Uh, sometimes an unsung hero, so we really appreciate her. Uh, and uh, by the way, like I said, subscribe to uh, Know Your Gear, and I, uh, I'll put a link below as well. I think I'll go ahead and put a link to uh, Philip's uh, merch, uh, so you can go there. I don't know if this will be available in his merch shop, but uh, uh, it could show up there soon. And uh, but. Get yourself a Know Your Gear t-shirt, get yourself a mug, whatever. Uh, and once again, thank you, Philip. I really do appreciate it. And uh, well, let's be good. Let's all just be good. Take care. <laughs>